Should I take my KSEO hat off or leave it on? I think here's what happens if I take it off. I think you not as good. No, 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 no. It's got to go back on. It has a lot of color, and that's uh, it's kind of your brand. It is sort of, yeah. Just tell me again, Andy. How long have you owned KSEO radio station? Since uh, January thirty first, nineteen ninety one. So that'll be twenty nine years, pretty quick. And uh, and how did how did the radio station lead to you meeting Dr. Joel Wallach? Oh, great question. Um, I had a rude awakening. I thought that when you're the owner of a radio station, you make money, but instead you uh, make less money than the minimum wage people that work at the radio station. See, that was a big shock to me because it was horrible. And after um, four years, my brother had figured that out because he was a, an original partner with me along with my parents um, in the purchase of the radio station, KSCO. And he was real smart. He could see within a month or two that this place was, that this wasn't a viable business compared to his business, which was a medical business, right? He was a diagnostic radiologist. And um, so it became clear to him that it wasn't going to be a profitable business. And after about another four and a half, five years, it became clear to me that it wasn't going to be a profitable business. And that was about the time that there was a consolidation in the radio industry. It used to be, when I got the station, that a single owner could own one AM and one FM station in the same market. Then a year or two later, it went to two and two. And about four or five years after that, it essentially became limitless. There is a limit, but it's such a high limit, it's essentially no limit. So and that's what, in my opinion, has totally destroyed diversity and localism in the broadcasting industry. But let's get positive. Uh, I was about to put the radio station on the block and sell it for the value of the real estate, it's, which is significant because it's on its own lagoon and the lagoon connects to the Pacific Ocean. So it's essentially California waterfront property. It's got some serious intrinsic value. So, uh, but before I could do that, I guess it wasn't meant to be. Uh, this interesting character, alternative doctor fell out of the sky and wanted to buy some time on the radio station. It was Dr. Joel Wallach. I had not heard of him at the time in 1994, but he had had a really successful nutritional health lecture called Dead Doctors Don't Lie that had been heard by millions of people, like over 10 or 15 million people by then in 1994, the end of 1994. And he was inquiring about what it would cost to do an alternative health call-in show for an hour once a week. And I told him he liked the price. And we started um, within a few days. And it worked so well for him that he wanted to know if I had any more time that I would sell him. <laughs> And I said, sure, what you, whatever you want. <laughs> and um, I knew him for almost two years. And he, with, after about three or four months, he had become my largest single advertiser on KSEO. And um, after close to a couple of years, I learned that the business model he uses is the same as Amway. You know, relationship, also known as network, also known as multi-level, although that's a, a, a description, a name that rubs a lot of people the wrong way. It's sort of developed a not great reputation over the years. and It certainly had with me. And when I found out that he does my multi-level marketing, I became fascinated with the way he does it, which was totally inoffensive to me and inoffensive to so many people. Um, because he uses the power of talk radio merged with the power of um, education and uh, in health and nutrition, which just about everybody's interested in. The older you are, the more interested you are in health and nutrition. You know, uh, people who are young, they, they don't 
worry about, you know, getting older and losing their functions, <laughs> you know. <laughs> uh, but uh, the older you get, the more you worry about those kinds of things. Uh, so, yeah, one day um, uh, it, it, it occurred to me that uh, I should help Dr. Wallach spread his message. And that's what we ended up doing. I ended up joining the company that he founded, Longevity, and uh, within not too long after making that decision, um, there was, wasn't a problem with money coming into the radio station. So that was, I don't know, a quarter of a century ago. What was it about the way that you grew your distributorship that made it work? I had Doc Wallach do all the selling for me, which he was happy to do. That There's nothing that makes him happier than having an audience of people listening to him, uh, educating them about health, whether that audience is one-on-one -on -one or whether it's one on several million. You know, on, a, on a radio or a television show that's seen by, or, or an internet program, whatever. I going to say, in terms of somebody who's entering into the longevity business, uh, what, what key advice do you have for them in terms of what works and what doesn't work? What works for me is taking advantage of the most amazing tool that you can have if you're in the health supplement business. And that's Dr. Wallach doing all your selling for you. And you can do that by um, using, by putting on meetings where you play videos of Dr. Wallach or audios of Dr. Wallach or radio shows of Dr. Wallach. And better yet, if you arrange a um, interview with a radio station or a, pod, a popular podcaster or do a YouTube video on your own. Doc Wallach loves to give his message to anyone who will listen. And that's the, if you take advantage of Dr. Wallach to help you sell these uh, premium quality grade A nutritional supplements from Longevity, the company that he and his family co-founded in 1997, then I believe you are going to have a successful business. Because if you ask anybody who's in business for him or herself what the toughest part about that business is, you're going to probably be told the selling. The selling is tough and the advertising is expensive. With our business model, the selling is all taken care of. Dr. Wallach does it for us. If you know how to take advantage of his willingness to do that. And there is no cost in advertising because under the the system that we developed, when was it? Starting in 1996, 97, we don't pay for advertising. We produce business tools for stations and podcasters and webmasters to use to promote the longevity products and the longevity business. And we offer to make those tools available to anyone who wants to use them, provided they're a longevity distributor and signed up in our sales organization. They get unlimited free use of our media tools. I haven't made a dime from longevity by not using media. Maybe there are other people who have or who know how to. I don't. I know how to make very good money and, and help a lot of people along the way using the Doc Wallach's uh, background in health and nutrition and his sales ability. 
to promote health supplements um, in a very, very effective way. And so it, it's such a, it's a simple, simple, simple concept. It's available to anybody for free if they're a longevity distributor in, in our line within two or three levels. Now, um, you just described a bunch of the advantages of, uh, of being part of our line. Uh, it, it would be um, great for you to just give a pitch, ask for the sale, say, come join our, our line, and this is why, something along those lines. Many people have tried other network marketing or multi-level marketing businesses without success, and a lot of those people are just turned off to the whole concept. But others jump from MLM to MLM to MLM to MLM. It's just they're part of the culture. And uh, there might be some other, you know, good, reputable, honest, uh, always there with the, with the checks and never asking you to take your commissions in the form of products instead of cash. You hear all these horror stories. There are probably more than Longevity that, that are available, but nothing, no, no other company besides Longevity has a Dr. Wallach to help you sell the products and even the business opportunity. But we've taken advantage of that to the utmost. And we, we've created tools for people to use. And it's limited only by your imagination. If you turn other media people, whether they're traditional media people, magazine, newspaper editors, uh, or publishers, I should say, uh, or radio or television uh, uh, artists, or um, ideally business people, or ideally owners such as myself, onto the concept, then you're going to, chances are you're going to do pretty well with this business because it's tried and true. And as I said before, I cannot drive this home uh, 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 strongly enough. The selling is taken care of and the high cost of advertising is taken care of. The selling doesn't cost anything. The advertising doesn't cost anything. It costs a little selling on your part to get a, a, a media company to understand that doing things totally differently uh, from the way they're used to, they're selling either time on the radio or television or space in print medium, um, you, you got to sort of explain to them that this is a, a different kind of a mousetrap, you know, that's very, very effective and very, very powerful. And once the selling is done once, it typically doesn't have to be done again because these products are excellent health supplements and they're consumable, which means people run out. And if they've worked, if the products have worked and you feel better, then chances are you're going to get on auto ship and it's going to become part of your life. When the act of getting on auto ship where you give your credit card and you specify what products you want to um, come your way every month automatically, th that's, that's a very smart thing to do. And so many, or many, many thousands and thousands and thousands of people on auto ship uh, in longevity, uh, in in our uh, uh, downlines, and and when I say downlines, I'm talking about the people who have signed up under us. Ninety nine point nine percent of which we might not even know because they've been signed up by other people who are other people who are other people who are under other people, but under us. It's good to be, get to know them using the tools of technology today, like email and social media, right? Um, but it, it's such a wonderful business because the products work and just about everybody's interested in health. Uh, if you're a younger person, you're not interested in fixing your arthritis because you don't have it typically when you're younger. 
but you do want to, um, you know, you, you want to have, you don't want to get fat. You want to lose weight or you want to have uh, better skin or you want to um, not lose vital nutrients when you exercise heavily and sweat. All of these things we have covered in Longevity, not which started pretty much as, as, a, as a making products for people who are older and, you know, have bone and joint issues and digestion issues and weight issues and so forth. We've got something for everyone and more and more young people are seeing that um, our products can be very helpful. And certainly those who get into our business. What, uh, from a business perspective, what advantages are there with the longevity, using longevity as a monetization strategy for a, for a media outlet? You don't have to worry about selling 30 and 60 second spots or quarter page or full page ads. What you do is you set up the media company as a distributor in longevity and you provide them with uh, audio, video, or print information that we've been putting out for years and let them put it out too, to their audience. And chances are people within their audience will purchase the products and chances are the products will do well for them. And if that's the case, chances are they're going to get an auto ship so that they get the products for free and they can change any time they want or they can gift it out to somebody. They can change the credit card they use. All this can be done online. But it's such a simple system. And when you're a media company, it sure, when you're, when you're a radio media company, it sure beats selling 30 and 60 second spots. And if you're a print media company, it sure beats selling... Uh, ad space. And I realized that it might be difficult for people to wrap their heads around this system. But basically, your media company, whether it's a, a, a traditional magazine, whether it's a blog online, uh, whether it's a website, whether it's a social media page, your um, media presence, your media entity is a longevity distributor. But you don't do what traditional distributors do. What you do is you pass along Dr. Wallach's very powerful health message. And you pass it along to your audience, however large or small it is. And if it's small, you never know. One of the people in your small audience might be a, turn out to be an enormous business builder that could end up having a much bigger you know, line than you do, but that'll never really happen in longevity because that person is part of your line and always will be. It's just a wonderful system. Um... I think we just covered an awful lot of bases right there. So, um, uh, is, is there any, anything on the, the tip of your tongue that you'd like to say? Always okay. coming up with more tools and uh, tools, media tools, mm -hmm. audio, uh, audio and video uh, for distribution. And anybody who is in a longevity, uh, just, just has a longevity business where we are the upline, ZBS is an upline. You get unlimited free use of those uh, tools. You don't have to reinvent the wheel. Mm. And there will be more and more tools. We're working on some right now that are really powerful. Can, can you just talk a little, can you just tell me what, uh, what the ZBS line is and uh, uh, why somebody should, uh, should Join it. I know you've sort of said that, but I'm going to edit this down. So. ZBS is is is, uh, is a offshoot of uh, Zwirling Broadcasting System. It's a little confusing because the, the the letters, the initials, are the same, but they are two separate entities. 
Zwirling Broadcasting System is the licensee of KSCO Radio, a uh, 10,000 watt station based in Santa Cruz, California. ZBS Radio Associates Limited <coughs> is a combination media syndication company and network marketing distributor for Longevity Company, which is a California health supplement network marketing company. So um, we are a top distributor, maybe the top distributor in Longevity. And people who uh, join under us have an advantage of being able to use our media tools and training um, to build their longevity business. And the major part of our tools are utilizing Dr. W Dr. Wallach himself as the most amazing, brilliant um, educator for nutritional supplements and nutrition and health via nutrition rather than via uh, uh, pharmaceuticals and uh, unnecessary surgery. What can you tell me about the Dead Doctors Don't Lie radio show? That was the original tool that we developed. Uh, Dr. Wallach had been buying uh, an hour of time from me starting in uh, November of 1994 through September of 1996. And he used that time to lecture the radio audience on the benefits of nutrition, uh, nutritional supplementation using his products that he uh, represented. And it worked very well for him. And when I found out, I must have known Doc for a couple of years before I realized that he was using this multi-level marketing business model. Now, I wasn't, up until that point, I wasn't a fan of multi-level marketing because everybody I'd ever known, I always equated it with Amway. And Amway's not a bad company, it's a very good company, but I always thought it was a bad company because everybody I knew from Amway was an in-your-face your was an in your face asshole. And I didn't want to be like that. So it just turned me off. But Dr. Wallach isn't like that. He just talks about health, the benefits of, of supplementation, uh, particularly through his products that he formulated and manufactured and have grown, uh, has grown over the years. When we started, we had like three products, and now we have way over a 1,000, I think over 1,200 products. I can't remember how many years ago, but it was a long time, probably more than 10 years have gone by since we started um, doing show notes for each show. Um, the man, Doug Winfrey, who is the executive producer and the co-host of Dead Doctors Don't Lie, along with Dr. Wallach, um, and Char Murphy, I should say. Char is Doc's original distributor from probably 26, 27 years ago. Um, and she's on the show with him just about every day. Um, and he wanted to have her on to show that you don't have to have letters after your name, that anybody can do this. You know, you don't represent that you're, a, that you're credentialed, that you're a doctor, obviously. But Char, who is not, I think she has a high school education, brilliant person but doesn't have letters behind her name like Doc Wallach does. So she's been on that show for a number of years as a co-host, and Doug Winfrey himself, the executive producer, is a co-host and the engineer who produces the show each weekday. And when the show is in the can, as we call it, um, within an hour of the show being produced, Doug uh, does a recap in, in, t for, in the form of text that has searchable keywords so that it can, these episodes of the Dead Doctors Don't Lie radio show, which has always been our principal tool uh, in our longevity business, um, will be easily searchable, easily searchable terms. Um, some of the 
things that we're working on now, um, I think are going to actually prove to do even better than the Dead Doctors Don't Lie radio show that we've been producing and distributing for going on 24 years now. 